Hi, I'm Neil with Covers and Camel Custom Seat Covers. Just finished installing the custom seat covers on this 2017 Chevy Silverado 3500. Great looking set of seat covers inside here. Again, these are made out of the 600 denier material, if you haven't seen that on our website yet, but it's, it's a very durable material. And this pattern is out of the Cryptek Typhon pattern. So it's the, the darker of the Cryptex. So lots of blacks and grays. Goes great with this interior inside here. Lots of black material uh, inside this vehicle here. And then also it has a black exterior. So a great looking set inside here. Uh, complete with the hard console lid cover here. So that, that allows that to still be uh, completely functional there. That folds up. Velcro attachments down below. Uh, complete with head, separate headrest covers, backrest, bottom rest. These are padded with a half inch of foam backing, both on the back side and the bottom side there. And also, it's going to have the front molly pockets, uh, driver side pistol holster right there, tucks in there. And then also in the back of these seats is a special ops package. So loaded, loaded up with lots of options for guns and gear inside here, and just a great looking set. It can be super functional for you. You get to carry the extra guns and gear, but then also it's gonna save these seats. These are leather seats underneath these seat covers now, and it's gonna protect that leather. So that way, when this customer needs to trade this vehicle in, it's gonna save those seats underneath, and those seats are gonna be in great condition and increase the resale value of the truck when that happens. Okay, again, this is on the 2017 Chevy Silverado 3500. Black exterior. And let's check out this, the custom seat covers now. So we have the Cryptek Typhon pattern seat covers on here. This is, there we go. And this is made out of a 600 denier, water resistant, very durable material. And just a great looking pattern as well. Again, the Cryptek Typhon. That's the darker of the Cryptek's. They, they do have the Cryptek Raid, which is available as well. That's it's kind of a darker, uh, well, it has some darker blacks in it, but then lighter grays. So the lighter grays definitely pop out a lot more. This, the Typhon is going to have kind of more of the darker tones. So if you have a lot more black, you're looking to try to stay more towards the black tones, then choose the Cryptek Typhon. But if you want it to, you know, uh, the grays to pop out a little bit more, then you can go with the, the Cryptek Raid. Okay, so driver side, molly pocket, that's what's showing off right here. Okay, so you can see that that has an opening right there. So you could put in a pistol, pistol on the inside or knives, gear on the inside of that, just a nice large storage space on the inside. And then you could also hook on gear with that molly webbing on the outside of it. Right here we have the pistol holster right there. That actually does work pretty good on on these these new Chevys where there's a little bit more space in between that console right there. Here's the hard console uh, lid cover right there. So that's gonna fold and function as well. Little cutout on the front right there. And then there's two Velcro straps on the underside. As you can see there. And then down there as well. So those two straps go around there and there's kind of there's like a elastic strap around the underside right there as well that helps it to kind of uh, hold around there okay and there's the passenger seat so same same type of deal over there on the passenger seat and we also have a passenger side molly pocket over there uh, airbag compatible so that's one thing we talk about with these covers is that they are completely airbag compatible, meaning that if the airbag ever needs to blow out on the sides here, they can just blow through that right there. So that's a common question. Are they, uh, do they work with airbags? And these definitely do. So they're all, all gonna be airbag compatible with that. So let's check out the, the back seats now. And we'll check out the back side of these front seats as well. And just get that seat back a little bit. Okay, so first let's check out the back side of, of these seats here. So I got a I'm loaded up the special ops package a little bit right now. Again, the special ops package is these large pockets here that open up. You're, you know, you can see my arm going through this. That's made for a rifle sling. 
So a rifle, rifle could slide through that, and it slides through that other pocket over there. And then also the same thing could happen below. You can have a rifle going across. You'd have to have these particular seats uh, with that hard console. You have to slide them back just a little bit to get that to work or unclip these little side clips. These clips are just meant to open up. Let's see if I can do it with one hand. There you go. So that's so it can slide out a little bit more. And both of those there, it has two clips on both sides. I can hang out a little bit more. And so you could have a rifle going across. Again, two rifles going across there. Now, the rifles, again, are meant to go through these pockets right here. That's kind of a common thing I see is that people don't put them through these pockets. They're, that's meant to carry the weight up here with that sole line right there. That's a big fabric pocket. That's for the rifle. Uh, and they're not meant to be carried by these these straps right here. Okay, So those, those small little buckles, those little small little clips, that's just to hold that pocket up uh, tight to the seat. Not meant to carry the weight of the rifle with that. Okay, so check it. Let's check out the back seat now. Here, so we have this is a 60/40 split bench back seat, uh, real common in Chevys with the two two headrest back here. So you can see separate headrest covers there. Here's that center armrest kind of cup holder right there. Zoom in on this here. So you can see how nice and flush it is going around the outside of that. And that's there's a little cutout that just pops over that and then just kind of tucks in underneath that once you get that over. And also there's a little cutout here. Let's see if we can get that zoomed in there. There you go. So a little cutout right there for that strap to come through there. So then you can push that back up like that and then also be able to pull that back out as well. So there's inside flaps as well where those inside those inside flaps come here and just tuck in on the inside of that plastic right there. Okay. Okay, so let's check this out. We'll fold these up. As you can see, there is bottom coverage. Okay, so you can see they cover actually covers that whole bottom seat, which is really nice because when you have that up, the dogs are in the back, or maybe you have this up and you have tools back here, that, that underside of the seat can get dirty. So it's nice to have that covered. That goes all the way down, down here, and you can see how these install now is Velcro on the back side right there. Okay, and that Velcro actually go, attaches on to a felt uh, flap that goes around on the other side and they just bring come around together and just hold on to each other that way So that's the same going all the way across down there same for that other Seat over there that bottom section of that seat over there the tops the tops are probably the most tricky part of the install on this vehicle uh, Just because you got to make sure on that top uh, Make sure to slide it underneath the seat belt before you start installing it and then as you're doing this top section, there's these straps that you're going to slide the straps down the back side back here. Okay, and you're going to slide all the straps down. They're going to go down underneath and you're going to reach underneath, uh, underneath the seat here. And not, not a real good way to show you, but where you reach underneath and they go to these buckles. And you weave them through these buckles and then you just kind of cinch them up tight. So you're kind of crawling you're kind of laying down on your side underneath with your arm under, underneath there. So that's a little bit of the harder install, but as you can tell, it's, it's totally worth it when you get it, when you get them on. It just looks great having a custom fit seat cover that's not gonna slip around, looks good, and is functional. You get extra pockets, you know, that's, those are some of the pockets. That's our Skinny Medic pouch back there. Thanks to, shout out to Skinny Medic. Uh, great first aid kit pouch back there attaches on through the, the molly there. And again, just a great looking set on this 2017 Chevy Silverado 3500. Uh, again, the Cryptek Typhon camo seat covers. You can see more at coversandcamo.com. 
Uh, lots of lots of videos and photos to show you there. If you have questions or you want to see a photo of a specific vehicle, feel free to contact us. Let us know what questions you might have. We're happy to help. And again, see more at coversincamo.com. Thanks.